Oh man, what have I got myself into this time? Here is a 2003 Honda CRV. I picked up for a thousand bucks and she's rusty. And that whole seams rotted out. This whole seams rotted out completely. Right here at the front, it's barely attached, it looks like. But here's the best part. The rear end fell out of this because where it mounts to the body, it had rusted away so far. And he just, a couple straps of metal and some nuts. Yeah, well, it ain't no better on this side. She's still hanging on there, but she's rotted all the way up into there. Yeah. Guy bought it from uh, someplace in North Carolina. Boone, North Carolina. And apparently they use salt there. So I need this for the engine because it was $1,000 for the whole vehicle. 225,000 miles or the cheapest engine I could find on eBay was like 1100 and it also had the same amount of miles so I decided just to go ahead and just buy this it makes more sense and I get the whole rest of the car yep yeah, I was right I've already done a number on this thing. Now I got down on the ground and it looks like the previous owner left us a nice little message. So that's nice of them. I mean, it should be pretty simple. So I'm going to get started on removing all this junk and um, I'll turn you back on when, uh, when I think it's something worth talking about. How about that? Catch me outside. How about that? Here's what I got so far. More dirt diapers, of course. Power steering pump removed, two of them bolts. I got the reservoir removed, two bolts right there. That releases this line. All these bolts for the intake removed. I think I'm gonna keep the intake and the whole wiring and stuff in here. These are the only two bolts that would come out for me. This one and that one. All of these are no longer metric or a bolt really. The PCV valve on all these Hondas, they installed the hose clamp upside down. So there's no real way to get to it easily. I got some other stuff removed. I got this intake removed. I couldn't really figure out how to release this, so it doesn't really matter. I just threw it to the side. Uh, you can get to these top, two top bolts up here, and then with a wrench, you can get this bolt right here, but it doesn't come all the way out. The other bolt you're not going to get to, so... We're going to raise it up, lower the frame, disconnect the AC compressor, and then probably proceed to remove everything, remove the other uh, subframe bolts. All right, so I got that engine mount disconnected. We got the air box out. We just broke it. <laughs> disconnected the fuel. Uh, dirt dauber. Check. These two vacuum lines disconnected. The heater hoses are down there. I don't know if you can be able to see them. 
Yeah, top one I cut, I got the, the hose clamp off, but it was just stuck on there. I couldn't get very good access to it. And then there's the other one. I got that one off, no problem. So I got the wheels off. I'm gonna disconnect this engine mount. So then I think four bolts at the bottom, it's gonna start coming out. I can sneak and get that one AC compressor bolt out. If not, I'm just discharge the AC system. Show y'all why you can't get to this bolt. I got that one with a wrench from up top. That one back there, ain't no way. Ain't no way. This whole thing is gonna flip backwards. So if it does, you'll see it here. Yeah, there's something wrong. It's just spinning. It's not even going nowhere. Let's see if I can get this rusty one back here to break loose. So here's the the top of it. You you try to spin it and it just it spins that whole shaft right there. Yeah, she gonna fall out. Yeah, don't do this, Tom. These bolts in the back just spin, so I'm thinking saws all and move this table up forward and we should be able to get her done. Get her done. Itching so bad. Yeah. I guess I'm trying to hit from the other side. That don't sound right. Right. <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah, if you just keep doing that, it'll probably break. On mine, I don't think we should cut the lines. <laughs> There it is. Done. Sweet. We may have missed a few connectors putting it back down a little bit. <laughs> All these solenoids. Uh, I see your problem right here. What, the canooter valve? Yeah, uh. you got a little leaky leak. We're just doing an oil change on this, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah keep going up a little bit. Keep going, keep going. Keep going. <laughs> there we go. I think this is heavier than the uh, Hold on. There's more connection. <laughs> this is for the crank sensor. I don't have tension on. Alright, now we have all the connectors off. And that's how you do an oil change <laughs> on the CRV. So, here is our point. How to find them. So, this mount right here. It uh, is self-clearanced. Yours probably won't do that. I that, hope not. That was just the Lord helping us remove this engine. <laughs> he knows what he's doing. Yeah. <laughs> I was trying to make this not like a junkyard style. It turned into a junkyard style real quick. <laughs> it's in our DNA. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. I said I was six foot six inches in that order. I didn't say I was six foot six. Well, mine's not as rusty as you can see compared to the other one. I still got my body mounts. Right there too, so. And I still got all my inner fender rocker bullshit. Brakes should still be good. I done them like six years ago. How are you? Yeah, they're pretty good, ain't they? <laughs> For single mother. All right. <laughs> oh yeah, girl. Break it on down for me. Oh yeah. Bring her on down now, boys. What? I can't hear you over all this hard work I'm doing. I don't feel like these nuts are about to come off this exhaust. These nuts? These nuts. Last night we let the leaker call. Throw some bees on it, bitch. Ow, motherfucker. Uh. 
Damn it, will you hold that? Damn it. Sweet. Look, you said they wasn't gonna come out. You think this exhaust flange gasket's still good? Oh, yeah, it's good. We'll Check <laughs> on that for a minute. All right. Oh, it's about to explode, ain't it? God bless, son. And now it's scary. It's like a bomb. Hey, let me just smack it while it's got pressure on it. Yeah, do that. <laughs> Boom, bitch. <laughs> Fucking ooh, this thing's nasty. Yeah, this is not a speedo cable. It's a shift cable. Yeah, smack it lower. You got pressure on it? Yeah. Oh, smack my head first on this exhaust, if you don't mind. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Where's your little angle dangle at? That seems to be causing more issues than it's solving. Is it? Yeah. yeah. Pull it out, push it in, pull it out, push it in. Oh! oh. Thank you. Watch out. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, man. Lost a piece of my ball joint. Dude, we'll put it back. <laughs> wobble, baby, wobble, baby. Yeah. There we go. Sendo <laughs> bar. Sendo clip, cuz. God bless. There you go. Oh my gosh. Mm. All right, now. Yeah. Thank you, ready, Papa. Yeah. Oh, we're halfway there. Oh, oh that had oil in it. She pissing. Yeah, she squirted, boy. <laughs> that ain't PS squirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, we got the whole top side disconnected. Um, got the motor mounts out. Just going over some stuff. Make sure we don't miss anything. Uh, but otherwise, we should just be able to knock these K member bolts loose and slide her on. All right. Now lift up. There it is. Yeah, so there. <laughs> right, yeah, fucking right, just stuck. All right. Oh, oh. Couple connectors. Move it on up. This one feels heavier. Come over here. You ain't gonna wait for me. Man, we don't talk about the time I started without oil. Okay, motherfucker. Oh shit, I'm gonna break a finger. Okay, I dropped that in the transmission. Make sure you disconnect your battery so you don't accidentally start your motor. Uh oh. Told you I'd. It's stuck. Yeah. Oh, we're moving free now. Yeah, baby. Chain. Oh. Where are you? Hey, there we go. Got some chain. Yeah. 
That works too, whatever. I was in Boy Scouts for any time. Teach me how to tie shit. <laughs> All we did was build soap boats and uh, Are you really in Boy Scouts? Yeah. How do I not know this? Because I don't even know if you were alive. You weren't alive. Oh, you know, that'll do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you go. Oh, very nice. <laughs> she busting loose. Boy, boy, that's a divorce. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Didn't even cost nothing. It cost that same as mine. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine, this is fine. I guess they call me back. What is that? I can't wait on the back. Somebody's GoPro. <laughs> Torque spec is too ugga dugga. Moving on up. You know what it's got air on it. Yeah, How's it go? You gotta make that noise while you're doing it. I don't know where all your bolts are. You took them off on that side. I don't know where all your bolts are. Okay. <laughs> yeah. well, I, say, I keep mine organized over here. I don't know what you did over there. Yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. I think that's how they do it at the factory too. When we have no distractions, it's pretty easy. <laughs> What's that like? <laughs> that's, why, that's why I sit down. <laughs> yeah, you're making us nervous. <laughs> Quit hand me tools, I'm running out of places to put them. I mean, we put that wheel underneath that. Yeah, yeah. It ain't running. See, you don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> Talking all that shit. <laughs> Rotate that one. These guys. Lift up. What do you mean lift Take up? Take it back out. Damn it. Oh, you gotta shave that motherfucker. I can't even find it. <laughs> there we go. I'm gonna clean this up for you. I'm nope. gonna rub on the rubber for me. There it is. How is it? Yeah. How's that feel? <laughs> I'll help a brother out every once in a while. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I keep family friend around here, guys. Thanks, appreciate it. I'm gonna go to the bathroom, I'll be back. Well, I'd like to watch them. It took them this long to get Ow, motherfucker. What'd you do? My head. All right. Got new ball joints installed. Didn't film that, because there's in a hurry. They're Moog. What that in there? Yoink. It's in there. Like swimwear, baby. Come on. Oh, yeah. We're lining up, baby. All right. All right, we need to see if you can jerk it towards the what? passenger side. Hey, yo, what the fuck? We need some armor <laughs> on. All right, this thing looking good. <laughs> it's pretty close right there. Start? Yeah. Hell yeah. Yes, sir. Are you almost done? Nope. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, we forgot to do the inspection cover. I'm doing half and half, half in the car, half on the floor. Gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> I know what you're saying. Break the fill plug loose first. I know, but I don't care. Oh, that don't look bad at all. 
oh, I should probably get a new crush washer. I have them, but I like the way that one looks. So we're going to just throw them, throw them back on in there. Oh yeah, I felt it crush. That's good. She had a, she's got at least a couple more crushes left in her. Get you one of these little pumps, they're handy. Let's see about this trim me. Let's see how tight she is. Hey yo, what the fuck? Oh. Make sure you, you get it all on the outside of the bottle too. That's important. I'm bringing some more yard art back this week. Are you? Yeah. <laughs> what you getting? Tractor. tractor. Another tractor? It runs. Tractor uh, and a boom pole. It runs. <laughs> you promise? He said the same thing about the last one he put in my yard. I went with him this time. With a starter, it goes ooh, 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 ooh. Looks like we're right about three quarts and there's some on the ground. So for about three and a half is what we're going to put in it. Should look like red Kool-Aid. Be able to drive this work tomorrow. That's the plan. Yeah. Oh. Perfect. No check engine light. She's running. I'm gonna bleed the coin. I'm signing off, guys. And remember, take her easy, and if she's easy, take her home. See you guys.